In this video, you'll learn how to set up and configure a new particle boron from the Particle mobile app. This video applies to both the 2G, 3G, and LTE versions of the particle boron. Before you begin, you'll need the following items, a particle boron, an external antenna, which is included in the boron kit, a micro USB cable, and an iOS or Android device with a particle mobile app installed. First, plug the antenna into the boron. It's on the right side, next to the name. Next, plug the USB cable into the boron. When the device first starts up, it should blink blue. That means it's in listening mode and is ready to be configured. If your device is not blinking blue, hold down the mode button to the left of the USB connector for about three seconds. For the next few steps, you'll need Bluetooth on your phone to be enabled. If it's not, navigate to the settings section of your device and make sure it is turned on. Open the Particle Mobile app. Log in and you'll see a listing of your existing devices. Click the plus sign in the upper right corner to add a new device. Then select the Argon Boron option on the top of the menu. If your device is powered up and blinking blue, you're ready to click next. Particle mesh devices use Bluetooth and a special data matrix printed on your device for setup and configuration. Click on the Scan Sticker button and give the app permission to access your camera if you haven't already. Hold the phone's camera a few inches above the sticker to scan it. Once the app is able to read and decode the data matrix, it will automatically pair with your device over Bluetooth in order to continue the configuration process. Once pairing is complete, you may see a screen recommending that you flash your boron with the latest device OS. The particle device OS is updated frequently, and if we have a new version available for your particle mesh device, you'll be able to update it here. This process will take a few moments as various parts of the device OS firmware are downloaded and installed and you should expect to see your boron restart a few times along the way. The app will now use the boron's cellular radio to connect to the particle device cloud and claim the device to your account. Once done, you'll be asked to give your device a name. Now, you're free to add additional devices to the particle cloud or start exploring your device. Congratulations, you've successfully configured your first particle boron and connected it to the particle device cloud.